house has a style, that's what gives a home its character. Hi, I'm Kim Hedinger, and this is The Reality of Realty. Here's a simplified look at the history of house styles in Eugene, Oregon. During Eugene's early settlement era, land was acquired through land donation claims, and homes were simple log cabins. As sawmills were established and dimension lumber was milled, homes evolved from hewn log cabins to wood frame structures. One of the first wood frame styles in Eugene was known as the Revival Style. The oldest Revival Style house still standing in Eugene is the Christian House, built in 1855. Other examples are the Skinner Packer House, built in 1867, and the F.B. Dunn House, also built in 1867. In the 1870s, the railroad allowed for building supplies and other building elements to be shipped. This meant more stylish and ornate homes like the Italianate and Queen Anne styles became popular. The Condon House, built in 1878, is an example of the Italianate style. The Queen Anne was a favorite style in Oregon from the 1880s to the early 1900s. One of the earliest Queen Anne homes still standing today was built in 1892 and retains much of its original detailing. One of the oldest and most well-known houses in Eugene is the Shelton McMurphy Johnson House. Built in the Queen Anne style in 1888, this prominent home was given the nickname the Castle on the Hill. In the early 1900s, as the city grew, the land was divided and subdivided into plots. Up until 1945, families would buy land and build houses on it, usually with the help from families, sometimes from builders and architects. As a result, we see a wide variety of house sizes and styles within a single neighborhood. The most popular styles during this time were bungalows, arts and crafts, the craftsman, revival styles like Tudor, Mission, Colonial, English Cottage, and Mediterranean. Building slowed during the 1930s and 40s due to the Great Depression and World War II. But following the war, Eugene saw a building boom. Developers purchased tracts of land and built standard houses, typically in the minimal, traditional, and World War II cottage styles. Then, during the 1960s and 70s, the suburban ranch-style home became the house style of choice. The split-level ranch, a variation of the ranch style, became popular in the late 70s and 80s and reflected an approach popularized by Frank Lloyd Wright. In the 1980s, a variety of styles were combined to create a contemporary style, where the core elements come from modern design. Environmental or eco-friendly styles became popular in the 90s and continue to be built today using the most modern technology. Today, home styles come from many variations of design and influences. New homes borrow details from historical styles, combining modern features to create a dream home. The residential architecture in Eugene offers character and diversity. Do you know what style your home is? And remember, make it a golden day!